hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel today we'll be cooking fried rice with my friend her name is peace and we'll be friends for 15 years at this point she's actually my sister during one of my visits to her place we decided to cook fried rice so come with me as i take it through firstly we decided to marinate our turkey so here are the ingredients that we'll be using and you can find them in the description below So after mixing the ingredients with the turkey, we decided to put them in a Ziploc bag and then transfer them to the refrigerator for proper marination. For our veggies, we decided to use different types of bell pepper and carrots after washing them properly, of course. Dicing of veggies is a very important step in the cooking of fried rice. It can be a tasking process, but it is quite rewarding, trust me. Wow, look at the combination of colors. Isn't that lovely? For hygiene purposes, it's quite important for you to peel the back of your carrots. As much as I love to dice the veggies, when it comes to dicing of onions, trust me, it's quite annoying. Or more, I almost cry girl, but I will not show you people. We spray the air fryer with an oil spray and then put in our turkey, our marinated turkey of course, into the air fryer and then plug it in. We didn't have liver or a dough as your bars call it, so we had to improvise and made use of beef and cut them into tiny pieces. As you can see, all our condiments are ready. Yay! Now it's time to wash our rice. I personally love to wash my rice as many times as possible to avoid stories that touch. Now we've set our pot on fire and added a little bit of oil, just need a little oil. After washing the rice, you need to sieve out the water completely and then pour your rice into the pot and stir continuously gently and continuously after stir frying you're going to add water in beets and allow the rice to boil we brought out the air fried turkey from the air fryer and glazed it with soy sauce thereafter we returned the glazed turkey back into the air fryer and left for some minutes in another pot, you fry your veggies, starting with onions to add flavor to it, and thereafter you can add your other veggies. Then you stir your veggies continuously to prevent burning. Now it's time to add our spices. After adding all our spices, we then mixed thoroughly and also added our diced beef. Thereafter, we returned the rice back to the fire and added all the ingredients, the um, veggies, everything necessary, and then stirred continuously for minutes until everything was properly mixed together. After stirring to our satisfaction, we then cover the pot and allow the rice to steam for some minutes. Our turkey is ready and it's time for us to serve our rice. Come on, hey! Mm. 
so sweet thing eh? let me not lie to you guys very sweet <laughs> so guys tell me did you enjoy watching this process and would you be trying this out please let me know in the comment section also thank you so much for watching my video and i'll see you in the next video bye